Hello friends, welcome to science for you Today I will show you how to do a snowflakes demo with OLED display and DSP32. You can set the number of snowflakes to be shown in the display, and it looks really beautiful. The snowflakes fall randomly, without any pattern, which makes it very interesting to watch. This demo also displays lines, circles, scrolling test etc on the SSD1306 OLED display. If you like my projects, please make sure to subscribe to my channel for watching more videos in future. Thank you. For assembling the components, I have taken a small cardboard box. First, we have to make small cuts in the box for placing the ESP32 microcontroller in the OLED display. After that, place the microcontroller in the OLED display on the cardboard box. The OLED display can be connected to 3V3 and GND pin of VSP32 for powering it. Connect the 3V3 pin of VSP32 to VCC pin of OLED display and GND pin of VSP32 to GND pin of OLED display. For transmitting data, the ESP32 uses I2C communication. For that, we have to connect SD a pin of OLED display to pin D21 of VSP32 and SCL pin of OLED display to D22 pin of VSP32. Now, for powering the ESP32, we have to connect battery to V and MGND pins. So I have taken a battery pack with two numbers of 3.7 volt 18650 batteries. Take a jumper wire and connect one end to V and MGND pins of ESP32. Connect the positive and negative terminals of battery to the other end of the jumper wire so that positive terminal of battery is connected to V and pin of VSP32 and negative terminal of battery is connected to G and D pin of VSP32. The connections are now complete. Now, open IDE software in PC or laptop. Connect the ESP32 to PC or laptop using USB cable. Go to File, Examples, and select SSD1306 128x64SPI in Custom Library. Make sure you install all the libraries before uploading the code. In this line you can define the number of snowflakes to be displayed. Go to Tools and select Board as ESP32 Development Module. Change Flash Mode to DIO if QIO does not work for you. Also make sure the correct port is selected. Now click on Upload the code. After uploading the code, you can see that a demo is started in the OLED display consisting of several patterns and text. After that, the snowflakes demo is displayed, which looks very beautiful. The snowflakes fall randomly, without any pattern, which makes it very interesting to watch. If you like my projects, please do not forget to subscribe to my channel for watching more videos in future. Thank you.